Now, the worst case financial scenario for America looks like it's unfolding. Oil is going back to those record highs and inflation is going to go there with it. And this time there's going to be no getting up off the mat. This is going to be a knockout blow for America. You're going to have millions of people on the streets. And I'm not talking about a homeless crisis where you have a few hundred people over on this side of town in tents. No, I'm talking about all over America. Now, a lot of people in small towns say, well, that's not my problem. Listen, America is an ecosystem. If you take the mosquitoes out of the forest, it can throw everything off. Because the bats eat the mosquitoes and the snakes eat the bats. And now that the mosquitoes are gone, well, the snakes are looking for food. And before you know it, they've climbed in your bed and have bitten you. And that's where we're at. You can point to one side of the coast or one city. Maybe it's red, maybe it's blue, but this is all one country. And think of it as your body and your big toe is infected. Now, maybe everyone doesn't get to see your big toe and you can still walk around. But that infection is going to weigh on your body. And before long, you're going to lose your foot then you're going to lose your leg and then your entire body. So this next spot of inflation from oil and gasoline rises, this is going to be a knockout blow. This is going to be an uppercut from Mike Tyson in 1992. And there won't be any getting up because already we're seeing 401k hardship withdrawals at record highs. We're seeing car repossessions at record highs. We have 20 million Americans more than two months behind on their electricity bills. We have 8 million Americans behind on rent. And regardless of what the talking heads in the media are telling us how great this economy is, when that price at the pump goes up another dollar, another dollar fifty, you're going to see a change of tune. But by then, it's going to be too late. We have the savings rate going down. Now, the stock market is doing great. And that's good. That's helping a bit. But as I've said before, the bottom 50 percent of America is not in stocks. So NVIDIA going up every week, that's not helping these guys. And at this point, all I can say is prepare. We've already hit the iceberg and we're taking on water. And the water temperature is 33 degrees. Now, if you like this type of content, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.